so we're now waiting on Claudio that as a good Italian is late and uh, what I think we're gonna do is 2 to 3k swimming in this beautiful place and after that we're gonna put our shoes on and go for a 5 to 10k run I don't know what's his plan but we'll figure it out I also wanted to go cycling this morning but Bali some morning can get really rainy it just stopped now and it, it was far too dangerous to get out with a bike so we're just gonna call it swim and run today and then uh, I'll try to recover my cycle tomorrow morning So warm up, 400 meters, then some drills, then correct me if I'm wrong, 50, 100, 150, 200, and then back again, 200, 150, 100, and 50 with each 50 meters within 50 seconds, correct? Correct. And that's one kilometer pyramid, then you do 100 meter recovery, I needed some rest, he could have gone. He waited for me and now we did it again. So it was a total three kilometer session. Now shoes and socks on and 1540 every kilometer. 1640 each kilometer, which is two minutes faster than my kilometer three days ago. <laughs> so that's quite of a PB. And now shoes and socks on and we go running. Easy PB. We all on a 5k, easy pace, just some fun around Bali. We've done 5k at 5 minutes pace, so nice and easy. You can shop Claudio, he's almost here. It is a great pacer for me when we swim, really kick my ass off. But running is not necessarily strength, so now it's my time to set the pace for him. But finishing strong. It was a lovely morning of training. Let's go, boy. All right, so morning training done, food is done, time with my fiance is done, now it's time to work. Uh, my job, I work online, uh, I have a partner in Australia and we run an uh, online programming company and uh, so that's what I do for, for my job. So although I'm really active, I actually have a sort of a, an office job, I'm sitting a lot of time on my computer working uh, and designing program for our athletes. Uh, my business partner, he look after more the, the group program that we offer and I look after um, mainly individual clients. So I usually work something between four to six to eight hours a day. It really depends how much work I need to, I need to do. And the way I structure it is I spend my first one to one and a half hour just to reply to all the comments that I get from the previous day of training. So I always check in with every client every day, check what they've done, what went right, what went wrong and adjust. And then I just look at all their videos. So everyone sends me a video about their form on gymnastic or weightlifting or whatever movement they need help with. And then I just correct and send it back. So that's how I spend my first one to one and a half hour. And then after that, I'm gonna start to design program for all of them. So that takes me quite some time. And that's why I spend anything between four to eight hours a day uh, just by doing that. I, today's Saturday. 
I don't know when this video will be out, but today's Saturday. I usually try to work just Monday to Friday and try to keep some time off for myself on the weekend, but we've had a lot going on. Uh, I'm gonna share more about it in the in the future videos, but uh, we've had so much things going on lately that I felt a little bit behind with my work, and so to stay on pace, I need to work also on the weekend, uh, but it's fine. I actually like my job, and also like I can't just enjoy myself if I know that I'm behind with my job or I haven't done what I need to do. And I always like my athletes to be, you know, five, six weeks ahead with their progression that then I can adjust, but I want everyone to know what they're working towards too. So I don't like to just make stuff up uh, out of nowhere. So everyone always have to have like their pre-training ahead and that gives me clarity and I know exactly what I'm doing. So here's what I'm gonna do now for the next uh, three, four hours. So I'm just gonna sit down and work and I'll catch you later. four or five hours done uh, I thought I was gonna record something more about today like my dinner and everything but I'm actually cooked so nothing more for today uh, this is probably gonna be my first YouTube video anyway so I think it's a good place to start like nothing uh, nothing crazy nothing too much but uh, yeah this is it for the day um, I'm gonna try to shoot more stuff regard like uh, training and what I eat and what I do with my life and how's Bali and all that but uh, this is it for today. If you managed till here, you're a champion. Thank you. Ciao.